Hello, our citizens. My name is Chris. I'm a brain education instructor from Torrance, California. Thank you for joining me for this eight brocade series. Today, we're on the fourth flow. This is called Owl Turns His Head. This is really good for helping our neck, for helping our heart, our pericardium, and it's for reducing fatigue. So let's get into our practice. We're going to bring our feet about shoulder width apart and just gently start to bounce. Good. We want to start to activate the energy. So feel your feet seal the earth a little. Exaggerate through the knees, through the hips, exaggerate through the shoulders. <sighs> start to identify where you have stress and the tension. You can shake your head. You can twist your body. So initially we want to identify where we're holding stress and tension. We want to bring our mind back into our body. So gentle vibration is a very powerful way to connect mind to body. And then to assess our condition. And then once we know our condition, we can change our condition. Eight brocades are a very powerful way to help us uh, adjust our condition. Often used in medical Qigong, uh, very ancient one. slow stop feel the body and now we're going to bring our feet close together almost touching into our zero point or our home position seal your feet little bend in the knees a little tuck of the tailbone a little lift of the stern reach your crown for the sky try to stack our bones so that they can float and the muscles can relax a little space under the armpits don't squeeze yourself relax and now with your breath, as you inhale, let your whole body expand like you're inflating. And as you exhale, releasing, letting go of any stress or any tension. Good. Deep breath in. Where does your body feel good and not so good? Breathe in. And out. Continuing with this expansion and contraction breath, we're going to start to open up our stance. So bring your weight onto your left foot, a mirroring for your convenience. Move your right foot out about shoulder width apart. Good. Settle in to your stance. Open your knees, tuck your tailbone, lift your sternum. Those cues are pretty standard. Reach the crown for the sky. Let those bones stack even in the new posture. And then breathe in and expand. And out. Now, for this owl turns his head, I'm going to show you the arms first. You're going to push the heels of the hands down towards the earth and pull the back of the hands towards the ceiling. You can open your palms a little bit more. So the more active you open your hands, the more you stretch, the more sensation you might feel energy. So you can make it as aggressive as you need or as gentle as you need. So pushing the heels down, pulling the back of the hands. So now with our inhale, our owl is going to spiral their hands around their wings to point their fingers back. Keep pulling the back of the hands towards the ceiling. Yes. And then as you exhale, you're going to bring your hands back. We're going to do that one more time. This is just the arms. Inhale. Feel the shoulders start to open. So it helps the heart, the pericardium. And then as you exhale, coming back. So the name is Al turns his head, turns his neck. So we're going to inhale as we turn. We're going to turn our head to the right. Look over the shoulder. And as you exhale, come back home. With your next inhale, you're going to look over your left shoulder. I want you to turn your eyeball as well. It'll help you turn your neck a little further. And then exhale, coming back. Good. So with your flow, inhale, twisting the arms, pulling the back of the hands up, turning the head into the corner of the eye. Exhale, returning home. It's good for reducing our fatigue as it helps increase our vitality. So with each inhale, you open, you expand, you're wringing out some tension in the shoulders and the neck. Exhale, you release. Inhale, turn it. Exhale, return it. For those of you that have a lot of tension around your neck, around your shoulders, 
this can be a very, very powerful tool, very simple tool, but very powerful. You might feel some fatigue around the hands, around the fingers as you keep pulling up towards the sky, as you keep pushing the heel of the hand down. Keep relaxing the tension, letting it melt away. Feel the feet connect deeper and deeper. The legs become stronger and stronger. Good. One more to each side. Relax those hands a little bit. Now as you inhale, we're going to just gather some energy coming back to our home. Position feet close together. Let the arms hang. And if comfortable, close your eyes. Feel your new zero point. Do you feel more full, more light? Do you feel more buzzing and tingling around fingers and feet, arms, temperature? Keep lifting the sternum, tucking the tailbone, creating a more and more effortless stance. Breath in, expanding, and out, letting go. Deep breath in, and out. And now you can rub your palms, feel the softness, the warmth. New condition and then sweeping off any of the stress and tension you might feel. Your hands might feel a little sticky. Good, shake them out, shake them out. Good. So feel your body. Good. So thank you for joining me for this uh, fourth session of the uh, eight brocades. Please keep an eye out for the other seven forms and the full complete form that will come out soon. If you'd like to experience a full one hour brain education based class, please check a body and brain center near you. If you're not close to a Brighton Brain Center, please take a look at our online memberships through Brain Education Thank you.